just above, right here, where it says web and more. Click on the more, and you'll see sites. That's where we go for the non-Facebook person. Are you thinking of creating a website? And then you type in your password to go in there again. And then you're asked to go ahead, create a site. And you can start giving your site a name, like Facebook made easy right and it automatically gives you that as its name sitesgoogle.com forward slash site forward slash and then that's your account name you can only use letters and numbers then you give a little short description of the site um, facebook when connected with YouTube and sites Google can bring absent people into the meeting. Everyone is here. Okay? And so that's the theme of this website. As you go down, you have a choice of various places you can go. Um, you, you can create a lot of different um, website backgrounds. They have more themes on the right. So you can get a choice of backgrounds, etc. Oh boy. And then <laughs> once you've selected your, your background type, we have another code to go through. Oh yes, we love these codes. This one's a bit easier, though. Um, generally, I know exactly what this one's saying. This one looks like, look, uh-oh, is that a T? I think so. And it's shorter, usually. We are in. We are. Now, I'm just going to briefly go over the features here. You're editing the page. And then once you edit the page, it changes position again. You're, you start with the home page. You're going to go step by step creating the sub pages of the website. And every time you create one, you make a link. So let's give an example. We first edit the page. Now, what do we have here? Now, some of you may be saying, hey, look, I bought this DVD in order to learn about Facebook. Why are we learning about Sites Google? In order to know that your clients are all going to be able to participate, they must have access to um, a non-Facebook environment. First thing to do is set two columns. So now we have two columns. On the left side, I like to put all the, you know, contact us. That's a good one to put in there. Um, about this website. Right? That's a nice title. And um, let's see. Links to videos. Because what I'm doing is basically setting it up so that I can get anyone who comes to this site can quickly find everything they need. So, the key is you highlight, then look to the right. See that little link on the right? That's what you click on, link. Shows you a rather large page, and they want you to choose an existing page. We need to go down. It says, create new page. Let we go and create the page. You have to give it a name. Um, contact us, I think is a nice one. And then you can put it on the same level as home. Rather than making it up at the top level, I like to put everything under the home page. And click on the bottom to create the page. Once it's created, 
now we have to select this page to be the link and that's why you click on OK it has turned blue and while it's sitting here you can see the actual name of the page right there I'm going to highlight the about this page why not click on link I have to go create that page about this website that's nice put it underneath home create the page confirm the link we got one more it's links to videos this is where I'm putting my URLs the links that go to YouTube once the pages are up if you are working as a small business this is one way to make sure if you don't have a website that or if you have a website that you wish you could control instead of having to call somebody to update everything links to videos put it under home create the page and click OK to confirm that that's the link so we're ready to go and then you have to save remember all of this is happening away from your computer you haven't downloaded any software onto your computer contact us if I click on this now it says edit page up here just for your edification let's zoom in it says edit page if I click on contact us it will go to the blank page and then I can put the information there sounds good contact us edit the page make the two columns and thank you for contacting us um, our email address is Facebook made easy at gmail.com okay and if you highlight that line let's make it a little bigger and bolder and if you hit link and there's an at sign in there they will automatically make it into a link to an email so uh, this is an easy way to do it um, I like to put a link back to home on the the right side just it makes it easier for navigation and you, you get your list of other pages select home and then at the bottom click on OK and once again this becomes blue and because it's blue that's an active link I can make it a little bigger so you guys can see it there we go back to home go to the left save the page the it, it sort of contracts up it moves up because we lost that um, save page and just so you can see it again I'll hit edit page this line here disappears and so the entire um, layout after you hit save now we know that it's been saved these are now active links if I click on back to home let's click on back to home we're back to this we've made our page for contact us now we have these two empty pages let's go in and do something about those 